Have you ever wondered what it would be like to have a personal AI assistant? Well, now there's ChatGPT, an advanced AI chatbot that's taking the world by storm. You can interact with it and ask it for information and it will give pretty impressive responses for an AI. Sometimes it's even indistinguishable from a real human. I even asked ChatGPT to suggest me some titles for this video and it came up with some pretty great results. For me, the big question is of course, can ChatGPT make music? While it probably won't replace musicians for a while, it is able to give some suggestions. So I'm taking up the challenge of making a beat while listening to the recommendations of ChatGPT. Will it turn out dope or absolute trash? Let's find out. Okay, so let's see if ChatGPT can help us make a dope rap instrumental. Hey ChatGPT, could you give me some dope chords for a rap instrumental? as you see it just gave me a couple of chords to try okay, so the second chord uh, progression that it suggested was a smooth laid back progression and i'm just in a smooth laid back mood right now so uh, let's try that one out so i just laid this one down in fl studio uh, in fl keys and let's hear how that sounds It's a bit simple, so let's see if we can try some things out with inversion. So now I inverted a couple of notes in the chords and it already sounds a little bit better. Okay, those chords were still a little simple, so I added a couple of notes just to make them sound a little more interesting. So yeah, that's a little better. Let's perhaps look for another sound than this simple FL keys because it doesn't sound all that great. It sounds a little bit plasticky. Let's have a look if we can find something. Instead of FL keys, I now added an instance of Sample Tank 4 and took this piano sound here and... So that's of course a lot better. To make it a little more interesting, I added a, a variation to the first chord progression. Uh, as you can see here in the end, uh, I changed the last chord a little bit. Let's hear how that sounds. Let's ask ChatGPT what would go great with this e-piano. What would go great with an electric piano for a laid back rap song? That's of course all things we know, but could you recommend me some specific instruments? Okay, so now we got a little better answer. Perhaps uh, something like a yeah, trumpet saxophone to give it a jazzy touch. I think that would indeed be great. You can try adding a guitar or ukulele, some shakers and, and, and drums and stuff like that. But I'm first trying to focus on the melody. So let's uh, see if we can add some kind of uh, trumpet or saxophone or stuff like that. So in contact, I have this library, Session Horns Pro. I took two saxophones and a trumpet and just added a little layer on top of the electric piano that we have uh, that sounds like this i'll perhaps try to make the sax a little more subtle i added uh, this EQ here to shape the sound a little bit. I added some more effects with some RC20 here. And then I also added some reverb. And now it sounds like this. I changed the timing of the chords a little bit because uh, it sounded a little basic. Let's hear it now. Okay, so now I added this electric guitar sound from Sample Tank. Okay, so I added a little bass line over here. And now let's try to add some drums. I also asked ChatGPT if it could give me some tips on making a drum pattern like Dr. Dre. 
who told me to emulate the style, start by laying down a steady kick drum pattern and then add a snare drum on the second and fourth beats of the measure. Then you can experiment with adding hi-hat cymbals and other percussive elements to create a more dynamic and interesting pattern. Additionally, try to focus on samples of recordings and drums rather than using drum machine sounds. I'm not gonna copy it exactly, but I'm definitely gonna try to add some real drum sounds. Here in the previous question that we asked, told us to add some percussion like shakers, tambourine, or congas to add a groovy feel so uh, i'm gonna try to find some real samples of that and try to add that in the drums so i had found this uh, conga loop and because the note wasn't set correctly it sounds a little bit funny I'll, I'll let you hear how it sounds but actually it's pretty dope so this can definitely be nice to layer with the drums and the real conga loop sounds like this I changed the sax sound a little bit. Uh, I changed these notes here. I'll let it play for you guys. I just think it sounds a little better than what it was previously. Okay, so I added a couple of drums right now. So we have the conga loop, we have a little shaker, a kick and a snare, and then uh, some tape click that I added as well. So that sounds pretty dope already i made a little variation for the sax as well so when uh the second part here it's a little different so let's hear it okay so chat gpt said that i should use a lot of real drum samples so i added a little drum fill here at the start I added these two effects to give it a little more oomph. Now it sounds more in line with the other drum sounds. There's some white noise in the samples, so I'm perhaps also going to add a little uh, white noise riser or something, or some vinyl sound to not make it stand out that much. So I added this little riser. That just makes it come in a little smoother. I also added a little bit of EHS noise on one specific bus. This just helps to make it sound more organic. It's very subtle. I'd still like to add some interesting ear candy, so let's ask ChatGPT what would be great for that. Hey ChatGPT, what ear candy would be great for a laid back hip hop beat. A GPT suggested that we use some jazzy horns, uh, so I added this uh, horn sample here. That sounds pretty nice. And I also added this sample. ChatGPT also suggested adding some uh, mellow keyboard melodies, so I created this little fill here. After the second hook, I'd like a more quiet bridge. So there's some open space now. Just slow it down a little bit. And then the beat comes in again. And another little filler melody here. Okay, so I asked ChatGPT for some good ways to do an outro for a hip hop beat. And so it suggested me a couple of things. The one I'd probably want to do for this beat is gradually come down, so a little fade out. And perhaps also add some skit. So I'll try to do that.
So I found this vocal sample here and another vocal sample that I added in the intro as well to keep it a little bit consistent. And then I also added these fades, also a little fade for the tape noise as well. Even though I still did take a lot of the decisions myself, this turned out a little bit different from what I would usually do. I do wonder if I owe royalties to ChatGPT now. <laughs> anyway, let's listen to the entire beat now. Don't forget to let me know in the comments what you think about the end result. Better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again.